Hey guys, today we are in Amish country in Walnut Creek, Ohio. About ready to stay at the Wall House. This is a highly rated hotel up here. We've never been in here before. We're pretty excited about seeing it. We're going to take you a little tour. So are you ready, Bobby? I'm ready. Let's rock and roll. Let's rock and roll. What do you think, Bobby? What's your first impression? It's very modern, isn't it? Very modern, because we are in Amish country. I like this fireplace. Yeah, the I fireplace. Like the trees where they have put the lighting in them. That is pretty. Catches your eye, especially, I mean, the floor. The floor's so shiny with them coming off. And this is your breakfast area. We'll come down in the morning and show that. The white couches, I don't know how you'd keep those clean. Take a look at this. Those leather. Mm -hmm. They are. Yeah, just look back. Now they describe this place on a video as something like you would find in Las Vegas. So modern. through here one more time here in the lobby I have what they call an e-room printer a couple computers to get on some nice outside seating out here in front of the hotel Another ice machine as soon as we get off. How you doing? Let's head down this way, see our room. What do you think of the lime green? It's different, but it, it's bright. I mean, the way they get it all decorated together, it doesn't look bad. But I wouldn't want lime green in the house. Here it is, 310. All right, we're gonna start our tour of this place. Let's begin our tour. So I'm sitting here in these pretty nice, comfortable chairs. I mean, I know they probably look hard, but the bottom is really soft. So it'd be nice here if you had your breakfast or drink some coffee, because there's some coffee there. Um, microwave, got your refrigerator, ice bucket. Yeah, and the refrigerator's decent size. Let's open it up. There. Nice and clean. Let's see if the microwave's clean. It is. Control your heat. Full size mirror as soon as you walk in through the front door. Let's go look at the bathroom. First thing, let's go look at the shower. Tall ceilings. Pretty nice. Come out here. There's your sink. It left you some 
conditioner and stuff. Nice modern picture. There's your toilet. The bathroom's pretty big. It is a nice sized bathroom. Hangers. There's your iron and your ironing board. The room's huge, isn't it? It's pretty spacious. Let me just back up and show you. Yeah, it's uh looking at it on this phone, it doesn't look as big as it really is. So two beds. Wanted to get a king. It was sold out for tonight. Telephone. Plenty of places to plug some electrical appliances in, but no USBs. Place to play your iPod. And these control the lights. The lighting is really bright. It is. A lot of lights. How's the bed feel? It's soft. It is soft. You never really know how comfortable it is till you sleep in it. Decent sized TV. A little bit of storage area. Bobby, what did you find over there? This chair. That's I nice. Like, I like the rock. You know that. And it's a recliner it's also. A recliner. Yeah, you don't normally see that in a room, do you? Mm -hmm. It must be comfortable. And I wanted to say there were plenty of towels in there, and I did find a hair dryer. Forgot to say that. Air dryer is not important to John. That's true, so I don't think about it. Little table. You could eat breakfast there, or they got a nice place downstairs to eat, but if you wanted to, you could just look over the countryside. Let's look at the countryside on this balcony. Not all the rooms have balconies. That's a beautiful house. Probably hates being right next to a hotel. So we're going to sit out here tonight and relax. Just take this all in. Decent size parking lot out back here too. Down over there is a fire pit area. Private balcony too because you can't, nope, you can't see your neighbors. So let's just take one more look in here. It's definitely modern, huh, Bobby? It is definitely modern. So you got to decide whether when you come to Amish country, you want to stay in something like the Carlisle, which has more of a feel of this area, or something modern. Your pick. They're both nice. We just stepped off the elevator. I'm gonna go look for the fitness center and the pool. Ice machine. First stop, fitness center. Let's go take a look at this. Nice bike. Couple treadmills, an elliptical. Nice bench. And if you want to hit something, hit that. Fresh towels. Water. Pretty. Just came out of the fitness center. Didn't notice this when we walked by. Here's your washer and dryer. Head on down and keep looking for the pool. Bobby, you just sat in one of those. How was it? It was comfortable. They're really low to the ground. Even though you said it seems modern, some of the furniture reminds me of something you would see in the 50s. Do you think? Yeah, I guess designed that way. I like the mirrors. That's neat the way they lined up mm -hmm. down through there. The pool was probably down here. There it is. Can we get in without using the key? Nope, gotta zap it.
Nice and warm in here. And it doesn't have a bad chlorine smell in here either. No. The tub looks nice. It does. Three foot. In the pool you have three, four, and five foot. I like the brick going around there. It's pretty. And right off of this pool area is a fire pit. Let's go take a look at that. Perfect. It is. Plenty of seating, kind of spaced apart. Couple fire pits. Beautiful house behind this building. There's your balcony. So let's take a look at the back side, guys. I think that's where our room is. Could be wrong. What do you think so far? Big and spacious, especially out here. This is where we were talking about bringing a pizza back. You could bring a pizza back, sit out here and eat it in the evening or out of your room. It looks like that just opens right up in the summertime. Let's see. Yeah, just slide. Summertime, you just walk right out of that. From the pool out to there. Just in case anybody cares. I have a conference room here. Pretty 220 decent, people can fit in here instead. I might do weddings in here. Wedding receptions, maybe. Unless they have another room. If you come to the second floor, either off the elevator or if you use the stairs, there's this nice place where you can sit and just talk, or they have a few board games over here. And you can look out the window too, huh? To the countryside. Yeah, see a lot of cows out there. <laughs> they have sorry, Yahtzee, there's a puzzle to do, some blocks you can build. And there's a TV, so that's pretty nice. Yeah. So you pretty. Can on your room for a yeah. It's pretty though, isn't it? This yeah. Hotel. Let's take a peek over the side. That guys. Big glass front. Let's look at the buffet. Sausage gravy in there. Biscuits, some sausage. Omelet, some eggs. Some of the fruit, apples, muffins, oatmeal, pop tarts. Cereal. I had one of these. These are excellent. Cinnamon rolls. Bread. Peanut butter. Your water. Very different coffees. Microwave. Some yogurt and eggs. Fruit. 
milk and orange juice, grape juice, apple juice, and lemonade. And a couple waffle machines. Well, we're about ready to check out of the Wall House Hotel. What did you think about it, Bobby? I enjoyed our stay. It was a modern hotel. When you first come in, they have the lights and the floors all shiny with the Bright. staircase. It, it was very well kept. It was clean, wasn't mm -hmm. it? Uh, the two ladies out front were very friendly. And we came up to their room and out in the balcony here, we had a beautiful view of the countryside. And um, I slept well. The bed was a little soft. Comfortable though. Um, took a shower and the water was hot. So I enjoyed the stay. Yeah, the pool. We didn't get in the pool, but that was nice with the uh, hot tub, fire pit outside. We went out there for a little bit last yeah, night. That, was, that nice. was that was nice. Uh, this is definitely modern. I mean, you're in Amish country. Uh, some of the other hotels we've stayed at up here are more like this area with the uh, country feel. country feel. This definitely doesn't have that. So this would probably be better for a younger person. We yeah. think. I, I enjoyed this stay, mm -hmm. and I would come back here again, but I like the country feel of the hotels better. I guess because you're in Amish country, and it, that's just the feel that I'd rather have. But it hotel. is very nice. It is. It was $140 a night. That was on a weekday. I'm not sure what it costs on a weekend. Uh, good location, kind of in the middle of everything, and staff was friendly. Breakfast was included. Great cinnamon rolls, and I showed you guys that, and everything else they had. So. If you don't want to go out and eat, which we recommend going out and eat here, you're in Amish country, go get some of this great Amish food. But if you don't want to, there's food here for you. Cookies down there, there's uh, water. What, you had coffee a couple times? Yeah, coffee all day. And I think at five o'clock the cookies come out. And there was still some fruit. There were some apples and tangerines down there you could have. So it was a nice day. We recommend this place. So if you like this video, give us a thumbs up and subscribe. Yeah, so until we meet again, J&B have left the building. building.